community midwife is important because everybody needs to have somebody like them. Somebody who understands them, somebody who's from their side of town, who speaks their lingo, who knows what they've been through, who's been through similar circumstances. All those things are very helpful to um, being able to relax and be comfortable around someone so that you can have an easy, healthy labor. I don't even see how we can really exist without a community midwife. I mean, the vast array of knowledge and just women, a woman helping another woman through an experience is something that's so valuable. I think the biggest reason that I chose to have a home birth was just wanting to create my own birth story. You know, I think traditionally we see these horror stories in terms of like childbirth is horrible, you know, you hear people screaming and everything and I was just like, I want to create the environment that I want to usher in and bring my kids into this world and I want to have control over that. So I think that was the biggest thing that pushed me to do that. I went right on Facebook and told everyone about my incredible experience. I was so fortunate to have so many um, women who just happened to be there and then a midwife who was so experienced and, you know, just knew exactly what to do in any circumstance. I was so grateful. So I would definitely encourage everyone to at least consider it the option and do your research and, and you know, really realize that you can do it. It can be done in the, in the most beautiful way imaginable. Home birth was like second nature to me. My mom is a midwife, so I've been a part of home birth my entire life. Home birth is a sacred experience, and I thought that I wanted, I knew I wanted to be in this sacred space, and my home was the perfect opportunity. I wanted to be comfortable. I wanted to enjoy the experience and be in control. And so from the time I found out that I was pregnant with 90, I knew I wanted to have home birth.